Everything we do at the Centre for Music Performance is driven by a really simple vision. If you're a student at Cambridge, we want you to have the opportunity to make extracurricular music a part of your life, regardless of what subject you're studying, regardless of what kind of music you're into, and regardless of how much music you've been involved with before coming to university. Musical excellence is hardwired into Cambridge's DNA and the Centre for Music Performance is really proud to be taking the university's commitment to music making at this level forward for the next generation. Um, I study history, yet I felt that's never limited me in the musical ensembles I want to get involved in. I've been involved in operas, I've been involved in musical theatre, but what's brilliant is when we get professionals coming in to give us advice, help us work on tunes, take solos on them, because it's really great to learn from them just by watching and playing with them. I think it's been so nice that we had the opportunities to work with amazing artists like Mark Kavuma, like Zara McFarlane, um, and last year with the Masterclass by Jacob Collier, that's just these opportunities are so rare and so special. One of my favourite performances was playing at King's College Chapel. Uh, we did Brahms Requiem. Uh, coming in with the trumpet, with a choir full uh, going behind you was really amazing. I've been playing chamber music from quite a young age. Coming up to Cambridge, I naturally knew that I wanted to carry on doing that. The instrumental awards scheme are a great way for me to carry on doing that. Cambridge today is an incredibly exciting melting pot of talented people from all over the world and from the widest imaginable range of cultural backgrounds who've had massively differing levels of access to musical opportunity before coming to university. The breadth of the musical scene here today reflects that. I've always had a little bit of a fantasy of playing drums, so that it's, this has been an exciting chance to kind of get my feet wet in that area. Last term, Music Production Society organized many different speakers. One of them was uh, Man and Dave, who worked closely with uh, Will I Am, and that was really helpful in terms of getting the professionals sharing their experience and uh, us being able to learn from people working in the music industry. The most important reason why Cambridge has established the Centre for Music Performance is simply that we believe in the value of music as part of a rounded education. And we believe music's a great way to develop valuable soft skills, the ability to listen, to work with others, to take a lead, to appear confident under pressure, and to work at something until it's the very best you can achieve. Today I was practicing for exams and I was just getting so frustrated about this one computer science problem. And I was like, oh, and then I was like, okay, time to go singing. And then came singing, now I feel like totally distressed. I'm, I'm so like hyped again to get back into it. Unilox provides a very relaxing vibe uh, where I can also learn a lot from our talented teacher, Carrie. So, yeah, I really enjoy the experience here. It, there's never any feeling of someone goes, you can't do that, that's too hard. It's always so fun and it means that my boundaries of, as a musician have completely been pushed like in the last couple of years. I feel the impact of what we're doing at the Centre for Music Performance very personally because the musical opportunities that I received when I was a student at Cambridge 20 years ago quite simply changed my life. I'm so proud that the Centre's now passing those opportunities forward to the next generation.